What's going on, guys? Is your oh, was it loud? It seemed a little bit loud. Uh, it should be fine. What's going on, guys? This is your boy Parasite, but I'm bringing another episode of Pokemon Alabaster. All right. So last time we left off, we were in the um, t Team Tectonic uh, area. Wait, did I battle you guys? Sorry? Hey, you know about the Geo dude who you find in these caves? They explode if they're activated. That's why there are holes in the ground in some places. So what me and my friend do to pass the time is when we see one, we throw it into the, the lake over there. They explode underwater and it scares every, anyone around. It's fun as heck. You should try it sometime. I had so many others found two kids. D did you come looking for them? If you keep going along the way, you, you should run into them. Although I, if I were you, I, I would turn back now. Where do you think you're going? Hey. <laughs> <laughs> oh, um, I really hope you attack the Geodude. I really hope he's not sturdy. Oh my goodness, I should have known better. <laughs> I completely forgot about Sturdy. I should have used Heat Break. Oh, I was expecting a Rock type move, but okay. Oh wow, you lived. Jeez, your Pokemon is strong. Okay, that's not funny. <laughs> I heard some of the others found the kids. I don't see I didn't see them though. Fine, I won't bother. Someone else will take you down anyways. Look at our li little heroes. You can go on by. I'm saving my strength for later. We were told to be on the lookout for two kids like you. You looking for your friends? Don't worry, you'll be seeing them very soon. Ooh, Scolipede. <laughs> Get that thing out of here. Thank you. 
that about the leech life. Oh boy. A bunch of cheeky runts. This doesn't change anything. I admit you have some nice Pokemon. Wish I would be the one to take it from you. You'll have to face the others if you want your friends back. There's no way you'll beat them. Ah, uh, I see. This way. This is so much easier than working alone. This will be even better soon, I can't wait. So you actually can rescue friends, huh? And you didn't bring anyone to help you? Interesting. The heck? Buzz off! I got my orders. You may as well just turn around and walk the other way. And at last, the guests of honor have arrived. It's a good thing that you didn't bring anyone else. This way, no one else has to get hurt. Just give a... Your Pokemon will let you two and your friends go. When you think about it, it's kind of funny how ridiculous these guys trained with Arthur is. You know what I mean, Shen? They go around stealing Pokemon from trainers that are weaker than them. What are you going on about? Give us your Pokemon now! And then you run into someone stronger than you and you wonder, Why couldn't I win? Well, aren't you a cocky little brat? I feel like I'm feeling nice today, so I think I'll educate you. No matter how many weak Pokemon you've hoard, you're not going to get any stronger. Try using the effort you use to scare inexperienced trainers to actually train. You're pissing me off. Then you can get results like this. Musharna, you psychic! <laughs> and by the way, the people you defeated before aren't our friends. But we'll be happy to defeat you all the same. You can stop now, Mushina. <laughs> Sorry, I felt like showing off a bit since you look pretty important. If you're still down to battle, we'll accept your challenge. When we beat you guys, you can give the kind people in the back their Pokemon, and then we'll be on our way. Sound good? You damned kids! Don't have the slightest idea what you're messing with! Should I go and try and find the admin? I think Chrome's supposed to be here soon. There's no need. I won't be embarrassed by some snot-nosed brats. You fight with me. I admit you caught me off guard, but you grossly underestimate my strength. I have you know I'll have you know what true fear is before I'm through with you. Oh. Was that supposed to happen? The music? Oh wow. Two levitate months. I mean Oh wow! You would crit me first try. And coughing has levitate, right? Yeah. Bye. 
Get that thing out of here. Oh wow, I I didn't really want you going for that guy. Ow. Oh wow, you're faster than Moshana? I thought your galaxies were extremely slow. Oh wow, I had an absorb bulb. <laughs> I completely forgot about it. I completely forgot about I had that item on me. Oh wow, that's hilarious. Get out of here. Oh, that's annoying. Also annoying. And how convenient that you paralyze just us and not the explode. Bro, okay. That's just very unlucky. Get out of here. Oh my... I hate those crits, man. Hmm. Paralyzed, but has steep speed boost. Yeah. Double Ampharos.
Oof, that did a lot. At least the light screen's off. I'm not sure if you're faster with two boosts now. Oh! You gave it a quick claw. Nice. Nice. No light screens this time. Why am I faster than you? I don't think that'll kill. Oh, will it? Did it? Oh, it did. I'm surprised. With the light screen and... It. Kids like you have no right to have Pokemon that strong. Captain, what now? Captain! It, it's alright guys, it's my loss. The two others are down to let her. Take their po Pokemon, take them, and get out of my sight. Nothing to do now but for us to go get whoever is down there, I guess. Move along, I got nothing to say to you. You pissed off the captain. S scary. To think you could beat one of our captains. I can't wait until the team gets its hands on your Pokemon. What do you want from me? I ain't got nothing for you. Oh. We ain't losing no matter what you think. So there they are. It looks like they've been knocked out. We'll need to untie them first. What is that sound? They blew up the stairs. Hey look, Shen. The boys are finally awake. Ugh. What's going on? We live in we're in a cave underground right now. The only path leading out collapsed. For now we're trapped down here. Trapped? That's right, Team Tectonic! I'm pretty sure it was Team Tectonic that did this. I think they used the Geodude they, that you find naturally in the cave to blow up the exit. So then, what do we do now? Dunno, got any ideas, Shen? You don't think we'll run out of air, do you? I don't like confined spaces, man. This isn't cool! There has to be a way, uh, some way out. We just have to figure it out how. Hmm. It's most dusty. There has to be a way out. Help! Somebody help! I feel like I hear sound, some sounds that are coming from beyond this cave. If the walls are thin enough, maybe we can break through one to get to another cavern. Hmm, let's see. I think I see one. Oh, did you find an opening, Shun? Good eye. I'm surprised you found that, considering it's so dark. Let's go. I don't trust that tunnel. What if it collapses on us? That's... That'll be a tight fit. Yeah, there we go. Oh, 
Not yet. Let's go in that tunnel first. Let's save the game. Never be too careful. Hmm. Seems I can't get through here without strength. So, not there this way. Huh. Looks like we found our way out. Thanks for getting us out of there. We owe you one. Our friends are probably looking for us. We have to find them before they run into Seep Titanic too. Hopefully we'll see you guys again. We still have to find Robin and Cyrus. We're not doing any good standing here. Let's go. There we go. Hey Sean, I found them! I'm surprised we beat you guys here. We've been a bit busy. Good to see you guys made it out just fine. You've been basically at the big city. We're basically at the big city. It's right down the hill. Nice. I think I'm going to look around some. And then I'll meet up with you guys later. Same. Right back at you. Hmm. Be careful down there. I kind of have a bad feeling. Whoa. Does Cassie look nervous? No way. Eh. Maybe I'm just imagining it. If you're looking for a sign of weakness, you won't get it from me. Whatever, I'll see you guys later. Same. I get that item. Ah, there we go. <laughs> Such a weird way of pointing it direct to me. Don't mind me, I'm just taking a walk. Hi, I like your backpack. Thank you. <laughs> Shen? Little bro? Is that you? Wow, to think I've run into you all the way out here. It's been so long since I've seen you. Where have you... How have you been? Oh, so you've been training up some Pokemon, eh? And you got... Four badges. Yeesh! I'm impressed. You got a knack for this, just like Esther. I just saw her the other day, by the way. It seems like her sister is doing well for herself. As for me, I tried pick being a Pokemon trainer, but I know I'm not good enough to make a living off of it. I've been talking to some people about getting into teaching. I always like kids, honestly. Speaking of being around kids, well, it's not really related, but it kind of is. Now that you left, you know Mom's at the house alone, right? We we'll have to make sure to call her every once in a while to make sure everything is all right on her end. Well, it was good seeing you again, Shen. Take care of yourself. I'll be around. <laughs> hey, have you heard? Team Celestial's lapping and hollering about the city again. It's the third time in the past two months, and there's way more of them this time. I even hear some of them are dressed normally and are blending in with the crowds. Scary, right? Do I look suspicious? As parents, it's our job to worry about our children. Just leave the worrying to us and you kids can spend time having fun like you should at your age. 
Our daughter just left to become the best there ever was, as they say. Laswin's worried about her, but as long as she has her Pokémon by her side, I'm sure she'll be just fine. Are you expecting something special here, since my house is yellow? Were you thinking maybe I'd give you a gift? All you trainers passing through are the same. I have nothing for you. It's always me, me, me with you guys, isn't it? You're always expecting something, but you never come to give anything. Not that I care, but you're tr like dirt in the house. Of course you didn't think about that, did you? <laughs> my bad! Hello, my love. It's good to hear from you. I talked to your sister the other day. She said you looked like you were in high spirits. I love hearing from you all. Your brother, too. Maybe with any luck, you'll run into Oliver. It's good to know you, you're you having all kinds of adventures as a trainer. Not homesick at the least, are you? Yeah, I know you've had a few years to accumulate, but you definitely have that adventure blood in you. Just like your father. Stay safe out there. I love you. Hello? Ah, oh, Shen! Let me see how your Pokedex is coming along. Hmm. So you've caught 92 Pokemon. Your efforts are truly remarkable. If you're struggling to find a new Pokemon, you may want to consider training up and evolving what you have. Hmm, <laughs> commercial. You look well-traveled. Travel in this region has always been difficult. Some people want to build better roads, but others don't want to disrupt the environment. Odd that this is empty. There are some things in this world that I just defy explanation. After living for a while, you just learn to accept it. Some questions will simply never be answered. You may have noticed that our table lacks chairs. There's no need to, for you to worry about that. <laughs> About as odd as just having a your room and like a separate hallway. Just it's so much lunch. This is a big fridge. This thing is basically industrial grade. Yeah, I'm glad. I'm glad that's actually a comment he made because that thing is huge. Oh, that's a real snubble. It's filled with children's books. Many of them are stories about famous Pokemon trainers. Are you a trainer? I'm so jealous. I'm gonna grow go on my own adventure someday. You feel memories from long ago welling up inside you. Will you take this moment to rem rem reminisce? The memories take a hold and you are pulled back to a time long past. S hey, guess what? Tag, you're it! Get back here! <laughs> you can't catch me, Shen. Oh, and all that dirt's lava. You can't touch it or you'll melt. Yeah, yeah. Oh, whoa. <laughs> oh, yo, whoa. Huh, we got them both? We got them both. Now what? We get out of here before someone sees us. You take this kid. I'll take the other one. Right, yo. The two of you better stay right where you are, or we'll have our Pokemon sit on you. Oh, no! Sit on us? You think that's funny? N no Then shut your yap. Don't get so worked up, it's just a kid. So one of these kids are Diana's? 
I figure so. She was pregnant when she disappeared, wasn't she? That was six or seven years ago, I think. Shoot, I don't remember stuff like that. You're the smart one. I go with whatever you think. Plus, the one on the right looks like the professor. I'm pretty sure he's Diana's kid. What are we going to do with them now? We're seriously going to drag them all the way back to headquarters? That's the plan. There is no way. Think of the reward, though. Diana's sure to go searching for her kid when she notices they're gone. When she can't find him, she'll know where to go. She'll come straight to headquarters, willing to do anything to make sure her kid is safe. Think of what the boss will say. We'll be set for life. Think about it. Do this right, and it will be the last job we ever have to do. So we finally sniffed out the rats. Who are you? My brother saw the whole thing. He came and told me, and now I'm here to put a stop to whatever you're doing. Hey, I think we should go and get Mom after all. No. Not that I see... Now that I see them, I know th for sure. These guys are trying to set a trap for Mom. We have to take care of this ourselves. You ain't taking care of nothing. What are you going to do about them, partner? We scare them off. Do either of you even know how to battle? Sis? That's alright, Oliver. Gardevoir has already foreseen an attack. Wait, wait, wait! That's not fair! We weren't ready! The likes of you have the nerve to talk to me about fair. I find that laughable. <laughs> wow, that is so cool! How did you get so strong? For real, how did you do that? Honestly, I just trained without rest since I first got my Pokemon. It's as simple as that. I trained just in case something like that ever happened. You guys should push yourselves to be the best you can also. Oliver, you already have your first Pokemon. Cyrus, Shen, you'll get yours eventually. Train as hard as you can. You'll only regret it if you don't give it your all. Your own power is the only thing you can rely on in this world. If you can use it to protect your friends and family, then it will be alright. Don't get cocky. Like my partner said, you're lucky you caught us off guard. Right. I'm actually not done with you guys yet. Gardevoir. Yeah! <laughs> Esther, what are you doing? I'm choking him. Stop! You, <laughs> you shouldn't. Why? Okay, fine. <gasps> are you alright? Come on, guys. Let's go home. What a nightmare. What do we do now? The way I see it, we have two options. We could e either bide our time for a little bit and then try again, or head back to tell the boss that we found Diana. I don't want to deal with that girl again. She's crazy. If we can do this ourselves, then the boss will be forced to acknowledge us. But on the other hand, I kind of agree with you. We'll give ourselves a night to think about it. Y you Where did you come from? Irrelevant. All that matters is that where my family lives remains a secret. To maintain that end, I'm here to dispose of you. Brat! Ooh. Good night. Hmm. I wonder how I remembered that part when I wasn't there for it. Don't ask questions. <laughs> don't ask questions. Remember the house. <laughs> there are some things that should just don't need to be answered. <laughs> Welcome to Squall City. I hope you enjoy your visit. How long have I been recording? 35 minutes? Alright, we'll end the episode right here. I will see you guys in the next one. Later.